Hi hey guys. <laughs> Good to see you today. Can you talk to us? Yeah. With only one day left until Chicago votes on the city's first new mayor since 1989, candidates and supporters were out to be seen and heard around the Windy City. Rahm Emanuel, the front runner for mayor, made a lunch stop on the city's south side, where he was greeted by Reverend Jesse Jackson, who had some choice words for the mayoral favorite. So Rahm comes today as a, as a tourist, but that is one who has a sense of the, the disparities in the, in the community that must be addressed in real time. Also at the restaurant, an outspoken group of Carol Mosley Braun supporters, some of them making it clear that they want an African American in office. Mr. Emanuel will not be good for the black community or the city as a whole. And that Mr. Emanuel voted 128 times against the black caucus. Mr. Emanuel is a wolf in sheep's clothing. No one has seen the real Rahm Emanuel. The Mosley Braun campaign even pulled a bus up in front of the restaurant, claiming that people were taking their signs off of the streets. People have been snatching up other people's signs. I don't know why, especially on the south side. For some reason, Carol's signs seem to be missing all the time. When we plant them, somebody scoops them up, and in that place, we see another candidate's sign. We don't know why, but that's what's happening. Everybody can say whatever they want about me personally or whatever. Focus on the issues. Focus on what's going to turn this city around and make it a better city for all our people. Thank you. Thank you. Across town, Emanuel's biggest threat, Jerry Chico, shook hands looking for last-minute support. Chico served as chief of staff to the current Mayor Richard Daly, and he expects a fight to the finish. Well, we expect a runoff, and I think you'll see that tomorrow, and then we could have the uh, race on and going right away. Famously dubbed the city that works. Chicago has been laced with political corruption and scandals. And when voters take to the polls on Tuesday, they will vote in a new era of the Chicago way. See you guys. Robert Ray, The Associated Press, Chicago.